Kansas Governor Laura Kelly is not staying silent after Republican leaders shot down her statewide mask mandate. Thank you for joining us. I'm Brooke Lennington. And I'm Molly Pat. Late last week, state leaders voted to revoke the governor's mask requirement. And now KSNT News Capitol Bureau reporter Rebecca Chung joins us live to explain the controversy and where things stand now. Rebecca. It's Democrats versus Republicans when it comes to coronavirus safety measures, and Republican lawmakers are giving the governor little chance to implement any restrictions. Yeah, let me be the bad guy. Let me be the one who mandates it. Governor Kelly giving her take on lawmakers' decision to shut down a statewide mask order. The pandemic is not gone. The, the virus is not gone. Uh, it's showing up in different way, shape, and form. We know that masks work. Republican leaders voted to reject the governor's statewide mask mandate last week, saying it's about making sure people can make their own decisions on how to stay safe. It's just time to get off that mask mandate, and it just sends a signal that we're with them. Now it's up to local government on whether to require masks. Today, Kelly did sign a Republican bill requiring public schools to offer full-time in-person classes to all students for the rest of the current semester. Live at the Capitol, I'm Rebecca Chung. All right, thank you, Rebecca. 